Penn State's Thon happens in the Bryce Jordan Center, but the love travels far beyond State College. William Swieger and his family were counting down the days to their first in-person dance marathon in 2017, when his cancer relapsed and required inpatient care. But that didn't stop Thon from reaching him. We were blended into Thon without actually being there. From mentioning his name on the live stream, to a poster for the family procession, to visiting the hospital, William's mom, Amy, says that's what makes Thon special. To make all families feel included no matter where they're at. Sadly, William passed away six months later. You've already lost so much. And when people just kind of start dropping you, it, it, even though you understand it, it's still really difficult. Um, but our Thon family never did leave us, ever. Not for a second. She says that love continues, even now. And to this day, they still make sure that William is remembered. That is the best gift that anyone could give to us is that he is still remembered and honored and just shared in such a way that um, it, it, he's still here with us, even though he's not. The family looks forward to Thon every year, especially William's younger sister, Denny. But when she gets to Thon, it's like Denny's world. And she just thinks she's like Queen of State College. So. <laughs> Amy says for their family, Thon is a connection they'll cherish forever. We will never be whole, but we would be much more just blown to bits had it not been for Thon. In State College, I'm Savannah Wood for the Center County Report.